Hello everyone, welcome to the Ram News Network. I'm Kim McCullough. ASU faculty, staff, and esteemed students are hitting the road to boost enrollment. Albany State kicked off its first presidential tour with stops at Westover and Monroe High Schools. The plan is to visit all Doherty County High Schools. Visiting the different schools give ASU educators and recruiters a chance to provide information and guidance to high school students. Teens also get a chance to see Albany State's drama and cheer teams in action. School officials want to make sure high school students receive a full preview of what's to come if they choose ASU. Uh, we first start off with Westover and today we're heading over to Monroe High School. So I'm really excited. We got the cheerleaders, we have everyone. We are actually letting the students see more to ASU than just what they may see on a Saturday at a football game. On-site admissions are being offered to students who meet specific requirements. Albany State University celebrated its 114th annual Founders Day, bringing several alumni back to the campus. The theme for this year's ceremony was honoring the past, celebrating the present, and investing in the future. ASU alum and CPO for Albany's Boys and Girls Clubs, Marvin Laster, served as keynote speaker. Alumni from the class of 1967 also returned to the campus to commemorate Founders Day but also celebrate their 50th class reunion. The class of 67 has set a goal to raise $100,000 for academics and scholarships. The Founders Day convocation was followed by a gravesite service for Dr. Joseph Winthorpe Holly. Doherty County's district attorney brought legal action to Albany State, but in this case, there was no jury, only a class full of students interested in the law. District attorney County Greg Williams Edwards spoke to political science students about how the law works. He gave them an overview of the legal system in Georgia crime. and answered questions uh, from students. Edwards is an alum of ASU Georgia. and says and, coming to the uh, campus is one way of giving back. If you are a supporter of the arts, this campus is the place to be during the month of April. Conscious rapper and activist Talib Kweli will serve as keynote speaker for the annual Circling the Elements Hip Hop Conference. Kweli will speak on April 20th in the Student Center Ballroom at 6 p.m. Register at eventbrite.com to attend. Also this month, Albany State's dance team will conduct a tribute performance for Nina Simone. Simone was a classically trained musician turned activist. A viewing for the public will be held on April 22nd at 7.30 p.m. That's it for the Ram News Network. I'm Kim McCullough. Thanks for watching.